When Dr. Cockett Huey founded the UCLA Center for East-West Medicine in 1993, he wasn't just interested in blending the strengths of Western medicine with traditional Chinese medicine. He wanted to change the whole healthcare paradigm. Conventional Western medicine is built around specialists with expertise in the body's distinct parts. If something's wrong with your heart, you see a cardiologist. If you break a bone, you go see an orthopedist. Skin issues, visit a dermatologist. Each condition is addressed individually. It's like having too many subcontractors without a clear understanding of the architect's design. Traditional Chinese medicine, on the other hand, takes a holistic view, approaching seemingly unrelated signs and symptoms as a reflection of disruption within the system. Blending the medical expertise of the West with the comprehensive approach of traditional Chinese medicine is a new model for healthcare, which focuses on preventive care and whole system healing. The paradigm shift is in understanding how things are interrelated. This is not just a new medical discipline that I have created. It is more of a new way of thinking. Born in Hong Kong, Dr. Huey came to UCLA as an undergraduate chemistry major, interested in finding new drugs based on herbs. While he was in medical school at UCLA in 1972, a New York Times reporter covering Richard Nixon's historical visit to China wrote about his own experience receiving acupuncture for abdominal pain. A light bulb went off in Dr. Huey's mind. I grew up in Hong Kong, receiving both Western and Eastern medicine, conventional medical treatment for a burn, for example, and an herbal patch or massage for neck pain. I learned that China has been training Western physicians in TCM practices since the 1950s. And imagine blending these modalities at UCLA to offer comprehensive care for patients. This was a young medical student's dream that basically shaped my whole career at UCLA. I completed residency in internal medicine because internal medicine has the broadest look at the pathophysiology of the whole person and went on to do a fellowship in clinical pharmacology. With support from then chief of the Department of Medicine at UCLA, Dr. Ellen Fogelman, and funds from donors, I established the Center for East-West Medicine in December 1993. What began as a one-man operation has since grown to 20 physicians and four standalone clinics, plus inpatient services at UCLA Santa Monica Medical Center. Our clinic treats a variety of conditions, including muscle pain, arthritis, asthma, irritable bowel syndrome, women's health issues such as painful periods, and menopausal symptoms, stress, anxiety, depression, insomnia, and migraines. Pain may bring you here, but we help you solve many problems. Treatment may include acupuncture, body work such as cupping or massage, trigger point injections, dietary recommendations, and lifestyle practices. Patients see a physician trained in conventional medicine and traditional Chinese medicine who monitors their overall well-being, not just the condition being treated. Speaking these two languages of healing offers two different lenses with which to view and solve problems. Dr. Cockett Huey, on the left here, may not have known it at the time he graduated from UCLA Medical School, but his son Edward, held here by his mother, Shirley, would eventually join him in the practice of East-West Medicine. In the early days of my medical training, also at the David Geffen School of Medicine at UCLA, conventional biomedicine practitioners increasingly recognized that the model wasn't so great for the aging population and the increasing burden of chronic disease. The fee-for-service approach of modern medicine can keep up with the needs of our aging society. Many middle-class families are one step away from medical bankruptcy. The evidence-based East-West medicine approach focuses on self-care and health cultivation throughout the lifespan, which can help prevent the development of chronic diseases and the high costs of managing them. It's not just the acupuncture points or the herbs, but really the construct of looking at the importance of balance, the importance of flow, and the importance of spirit. Both modalities are important. The current medical model saves lives and can restore the body when it's unable to heal itself. 
The UCLA Center for East-West Medicine aims to bridge these two medical pathways. The whole person, preventive care approach of TCM can lower healthcare costs as it promotes lifestyle practices that can reduce the need for prescription drugs and expensive treatments. While there are other integrative medicine programs across the nation, UCLA Center for East-West Medicine is unique in its focus on TCM and its integration within the broader healthcare system. The center continues to educate physicians, nurses, and other healthcare providers, as well as students and members of the public on its holistic view of wellness and the role of lifestyle practices, diet, exercise, stress management, and sleep in cultivating health. Dr. Cockett Huey dreams of expanding this training even further. Every educated person should know about this model. The Center for East-West Medicine has also partnered with community organizations to bring its care to underserved populations. An adolescent program is also being developed to teach children and teenagers the self-care practices that will keep them healthy and ward off chronic diseases throughout their lives. Now at 75 years old, Dr. Cockett Huey still has big dreams for the center's integration and preventative approach. If we optimize the whole person health idea and make it culturally competent for the 10 million lives in LA, in the next 20, 30 years, UCL will be the focal point for healthcare. We will make Southern California the focal point for demonstrating a new health model that addresses the healthcare crisis, making it safer, more affordable, and more accessible.